What's up guys, Ivan XTB here And I'm inside of the Jakarta Fair Kemayoran J16 at Jakarta International Expo Kemayoran This video will show you the answer of Samsung Galaxy J1 Mini Let's start the answer from build quality The build quality on the J1 Mini is still feel plastic Because it's a good size of the plastic And also black of the plastic That also make of the polycarbonate feel This is really good Now the Galaxy J1 Mini has get three different colors. It's get gold, white, and the cinematic video, and black. And it's get very thick phone. I think it's about 10 millimeters if I'm not wrong. Alright, before you can continue, let me give you a physical view. The blur the screen, when it's a combat, it's a positive effect. It's get recent apps and back case, but unfortunately, it isn't backlit if you tap. The blur the screen, find the earphone, Samsung made it in the PJ front facing camera. The bottom side you find the microphone, the microphone pool, which is where they're in syncing. The left side you find foam up and down buttons. And as you can see, this this get a silver foam is thin of plastic. The top side you find the trim up with the hazard jack. The right side you find the engine top knob back of and a power button. And in the rear side you find the farmer pixel rear camera with 730p video recording, but it is fixed focus, but sadly there's no LED plus. To the right of the camera, you find only the speakers. The movie series screen, the J1 Mini has to get 4 inch 480p by 800 p screen, which is good for 233 pixels per inch. Now, moving to the software, the Galaxy J1 Mini comes with the version 5.1.1 Lollipop out of the box. It is a really good thing. Now, moving to your performance, the Galaxy J1 Mini is bought by the uh, Square Tomb SEs. At the 30 which is a squad for processor clock at 1.2 GHz with Mali 400 MP2 GPU, 768 MB of RAM, and also have 8 gigs of onboard storage. But don't worry, it can add a micro SD card up to 128 gigs. The storage should not be an issue. And the other hardware is get 1500 mAh battery, which is really replaceable. With the connectivity features, the connectivity also supports as you get 4G LTE. Your Kojia 3 Cat 4, it's get single band Wi Fi, Wi Fi Direct, Bluetooth 4.0, and that's about it. But sadly, there's no USB OTG, DNA, and NFC. Now, which is the pricing? The price on the Galaxy J1 Mini is about 1 million. Yeah, which is this very budget oriented price, in my opinion. Alright, so that's very it for video and so of Samsung Galaxy J1 Mini. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up down below and so don't forget to subscribe. If you have any specific questions about this J1 Mini, do let me know in the comment section down below. And as you know it, peace out and see you in the next video for more Jakarta Fair Kemayan 2016 coverage. And also, happy Amanda's Day!